Today we're learning how to identify fractions on a number line. Let's say I have this number line and want to identify where on the number line this mark is. The numerator of my fraction will be how many shaded parts I have. If I'm at this dash, it means all of the parts up until this dash are shaded. I can count up that there are one, two, three shaded parts, so my numerator is three. Next, the denominator of my fraction is the total number of parts in one whole. One whole is the important thing to remember. This is my one whole, from zero to one. I need to figure out how many parts it's split up into. I can see there's a total of one, two, three, four parts in this one whole, so I'll make my denominator four. Make sure you're only counting up the parts in one whole and not the entire number line. And just like that, I've identified that this fraction represents three fourths. Now let's practice together. What fraction does this dash on the number line represent? Remember, when we see that we're at this dash, it really means we contain everything starting at zero all the way up to the dash. Now that we visualize this, what should the numerator of my fraction be? Our numerator is the number of shaded pieces. We have one, two, three, four parts, so our numerator will be four. Next, we find the denominator. Remember, the denominator is the total number of pieces in one whole. This is one whole on our number line. How many parts are in this one whole? We can see this whole is split into one, two, three, four, five parts. So five is our denominator. This dash represents the fraction four fifths. Let's practice with another problem. Let's find out what fraction this dash on the number line is. What should the numerator of my fraction be? The numerator of my fraction is the number of shaded parts. Being at this dash means we have all of the parts up until here. We only have one shaded part, so our numerator is one. Next, what should my denominator be? The denominator is the total number of parts in one whole. This is one whole on the number line, and we can see it's made up of three parts. The denominator is three. This dash on the number line represents the fraction one-third. Now it's time for you to practice on your own. What fraction does this dash represent? We can see that this dash contains two shaded pieces, so the numerator is two. Then we can look at one whole and see it's split into four parts. The denominator is four, so this fraction represents two fourths. Now here's your last problem for this video. What fraction does this dash represent? This dash contains seven shaded parts, so the numerator is seven. Then we can look at one whole and see it's split into eight total parts. The denominator is eight. Therefore, this dash represents the fraction seven eighths. Now you know how to identify fractions on a number line. Great job!